Link and his troops step through one of the portals, appearing in an era of fantastical sights. He had heard tell of a land in the clouds, but now he could see Skyloft with his own eyes, though he was not the first new arrival. Overrun with monsters, the floating island faced imminent destruction. Though vastly outnumbered, Link did not hesitate. He and his allies leapt into the fray to save Skyloft from disaster. Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Hyrule Warriors. So, in the last episode, we got our Triforce stolen. That kinda sucked. So in this one, we're going in where everyone's splitting up different ways to try to take back the world and try to seal off the different time portals. So, let's just jump straight into it. I'm playing as Link and uh, Skyloft. I am choosing just the Sword and Shield. I figure that's a good one to go with rather than going with the... Uh, the new one that I got in the DLC, the horse, because I'm not really sure how the area controls around here. I will show that off at some point though, so let's just go straight into the battle. I should mention I haven't played much of Skyward Sword, I only played up to like the beginning of the first temple, so I am familiar with Skyloft though. And man does this place look gorgeous. Also, I did a bunch of upgrades between episodes, so uh, if you notice I'm doing a lot of new power attacks, that's why. I did major upgrades and I just got a lot stronger so that I could actually take things down easily and I wouldn't be under level like I felt I was at that point. Oh, hey, a bow power up already. Arrows powered up. Too bad I don't even have a bow. Hey, it's... Ganon Jr. So he, I just need to dodge his belly flop and then I can beat him. It's not a problem. Yeah, pretty standard for these kind of enemies. I now have SP and I'll just target all of you to do a big spin attack and kill you all. Head for the statue keep. Up there, obviously. Oh. I know who that is. I definitely know who that is. Alright, we're going. Kind of. Wait, enemies near our base already? I kind of wish you could knock them off the cliff, that'd be awesome. Thing is that, throughout this game it appears that your enemies can do the same things that you can do, so I'd rather not be able to be knocked off the cliff, that would kind of suck. I do like being able to jump backwards though, and then do a strike that sends me flying forward, that's really awesome. Also, grabbing that weapon. Gotcha. And gotcha. Oh wow, I can run around having it prepared. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. I cannot do that with that there though. Oh, and it cancelled it because I ran up this. Hey there, how are you doing? I can consider you a master? That's not... Okay, fair enough. Keep 
by safe. Why would I want to do that? That's silly. Fi is capable. I shall carry this pumpkin soup. The Night Academy. Okay, um, bomb upgrade, that's useful. Just blow up everyone, it's fine. Is there, did we really eliminate everyone? Transporting pumpkin soup. I just want to spin through here and kill everyone in the process so I can go back and grab the SP item. Also get back to Phi. Because obviously we're gonna have to do that kind of thing. Phi, wait a moment. There we go. Leveled up because of that even. What do you mean the town center key? What do you mean? I love how much damage is stealing now. Well, VS. Who's that? Some kind of Lord of the Sky? Oh. That's interesting. Oh. Wait, the Windfish? The Windfish's name is Levius. Let's see the mighty Windfish. I love getting all these SP recovery items, though. Oh, gear him. Wait, gear. What are you even doing here? Seriously, are all the bad guys just getting together and saying, ah, we don't like you, so we're all gonna work together? Hey! Oh, hey, more uh, pumpkin. I love being able to run through a crowd of people and just slice them all to tiny pieces. Makes me feel powerful. Even if it's only feeling powerful. Oh, I'm defeating an air enemy. Oh, not quite defeating. He's powerful. Okay, there's an 85% chance. That's a decent percentage, actually. And I got you! Gotcha, Keep Boss. I also got you guys. Defeat him immediately. Do I have to... Okay, where is he? Uh, he's way over there. Let's run straight there and help out. As east as we can. Stupid Girahim causing everything to mess up. I can actually head back here soon and take control of that. Have this all charged up for this battle? Gotcha. Thank, 
Wait, where is Gear Game? I thought he was supposed to be here. Oh, there he is. I just totally missed him somehow. I guess he's much smaller than most of the huge enemies, so... And time to be hit by my X attack. I love the fact that sometimes it doesn't play the animation, so I have to watch it every time. I know that's probably just a glitch. Still nice. Getting right outside that fire circle thing. And I did my... Ah, I did the finisher. He was not a difficult boss. I guess he was just a mini boss, but all the same, he's... Wait, I just realized, on that... On that earlier area, we could easily have got that gold skull to our because I just need to switch my... Ability. Also, I love being able to spam giant bombs. No wonder this is an infinite. <coughs> Sorry, minor cold going on right now. So sometimes I'll cough and things, but honestly, you're the true hero of Hyrule. If you're not mistaken. Well, you're not mistaken. Also, I just realized that the uh, Skulltool is here already, and I didn't even notice. I should really be focusing on that uh, gold Skulltool right now, so I don't have to come back. Be right back, guys. Gonna find this gold skull toy. Gonna kick the crap out of it. Probably under that rock over there. Getcha. Got the illustration piece. Alright, not a problem. I love it. And let's go down there and kill them. Wait, what do you mean, rapidly failing? Oh, god. Fight! <sighs> Alright. What I should really be doing is I should be... You know what? I'm just doing it. Pressing X on this guy. I'm hating these aerial guys. They're hard to hit. Errol folks, that's what their names are. Now that I think about it, it might be a good idea to just use my uh, thing on them. What's it called? Well, I know I can use my bow on them. Okay, actually the bow flat stuns them. That's nice. I didn't realize that. I was figuring it might be a good idea to use my boomerang on them. Because the boomerang is so powerful, it might, well not powerful, but it might knock them down. That's my thought. Gotcha. That was easy. I did not realize that they all switched over like every item did. I don't know why, but I just forgot about that until I was editing, and then I was like, oh, wait. I'm an idiot. And I hit him. And... Come on. You should be finished already. 
Got him. Ooh. That felt good. And they got the next one as well. Come on. I'm almost done. Oh, actually, now that I think about it, I'm looking at his shield, and these guys, you're, I think you're supposed to use the claw shot on them. Alright. It doesn't matter anyway, because I don't have the claw shot yet, but if I did have it right now, then I should probably use it on them. If I get it during this level, which I don't think I would, but I don't know if it's possible. Then I'll have to use it on them. I'll have to try it at least. Or maybe at a future date. Properly transported. That took forever, actually, in this one, because I had to go and uh, kill Girahim. Alright. Thank you, Mighty Windfish. I really appreciate it. Gotcha. Give me your item. <laughs> HP and SP full, that's way too much power. What's up? Volga? Where are you? Wait, I've already fought you, Volga, and beat you. What do you mean, show you... Whatever. Prideful jerk. Alright. Gotcha! And Volga, take that! Knocked him back for a minute. So I can run over here. And get more SP. As well as a bit of magic. Sadly, you can't use your X attack when you're like this, your SP. Or else, well, it'd be way too much power. Ah, man, I love getting them into these kinds of attacks. Come on. Come on, Volga. Show me what kind of real warrior you are. Come on, don't run away! What do you mean? Are you giving up? What? Was I just really killed? Was I just... 
Give me a second, guys. Okay, now we're back, guys. Sorry about that. It took, like, three minutes. I just didn't want to repeat that in front of you guys. Alright. I'm going to have to run back and grab some more SP because he wrecked me last time. I need to get away. I just want to run. I just want to run away. Seriously. Blinks rescued five. That's cool. Wait, is uh, you were thinking about running away from this battle? Why would you even? Whatever. Bye. Don't even pull that with me. Also, before anyone asks, yes, I did just kill 30, more than 30 people in one go. Come on. Defeat Volga. Come on! You are such a... I'll meet you guys at the Fairy Fountain. I'm heading there. There, There isn't a way to beat Volga otherwise, I have a feeling. And now I'm heading back to that Fairy Fountain I was heading to before. Okay guys, I'm back. Uh, Fi's gonna have to hold that for a moment Why I go visit the Fairy and get some major help because I'm not gonna be able to fight Volga in this current state. I'm not high enough level for that. I'm sure it's possible if you came back to this area, but... You know, no. One of the two. Come on. By Stone Volga. Got it. Heading in, and we're finally here to the ferry. Come on, Great Fairy, I know you creep me out sometimes, but seriously, I need your help here. This isn't something I can do myself. Wait, really? Wait, you're gonna summon the Windfish? We just smited Volga using the Windfish's magic. Well, I better head back out there. Enough divine intervention. Oh, yeah, that's enough. Now I just have to beat him again, and it's not a problem. Because I kind of kicked the crap out of him last time, so, you know. Come on, he's gonna kill you!
Wait, a Moblin forced the Skyloft Captain to flee? Come on. I guess the smart idea here would be to take down a bunch of enemies to get my axe attack ready. But I'm not smart, am I? Getcha, and getcha with the finisher. That's what I was hoping for. Come on, fight. Just need a little bit more help. Gotcha. Volga down. Yeah, bye Volga, don't care. The Skylord's interference was extremely helpful, I'm not even gonna lie, Volga. But that's kind of the advantage of being me. Wait, did we just win? Yeah, Girahim, sorry, but you missed your chance. What do you mean? Oh, co no. No, you're you're not you're not doing some hypnotism. You're not doing some hypnotism thing, right? And now I have my trusty Stevie Pona. Which I'm not sure why she's there, but... You know, why not? I wasn't even actually using her. Though I do have her, which... I don't know. Strength 3 on the Night Sword. Darkness Plus on the Blue Ring, which I haven't used these characters yet. Oh, DLC stuff. Volga's Helmet. 4 Moblin Flank. 7 Aerophil's Leather. 21 old rags. And we got another piece of this mural. Mural. Mural? I don't know. I can't remember what it's called. <laughs> you can now battle as Phi. And you get the goddess sword for Phi. New historical entry is available. Phi, the spirit of the sword. Garahim, the demon lord. Oh. He's a demon lord? I don't know. I haven't beaten Skyward Sword yet, so I don't know much about that. So guys, next time on Let's Play Hyrule Warriors, we're going to be going back in. I... Uh, Hmm, should we be going on in Link's story, or should we be... I'm not really sure which one I want to do yet. So guys, next time we're going to figure out what we want to do. I'll see you then.